Hey guys, Chad at Pizza RV Center today. Exciting day at the dealership. This is the video that everybody's been asking about lately. When are you going to have the new Keystone Vantage product out? Well, today's the day. We're inside our dealership here, and we have a Keystone Vantage. Very, very unique trail. Nothing like we've seen before. This is a lot of cutting edge innovation that Keystone's put together in one trailer. You know, just from looking at the front of it, you see the one piece cap, the charcoal color. Just a lot of different stuff going on in this trailer. We're going to step inside in just a minute. We'll also go on the outside and, and show you all the bells and whistles that this unit has. I think we can just start with right here that I find really neat. When's the last time you've seen that on a travel trailer? So Let's take a moment. We'll head right inside and we'll show you all the, all the bells and whistles and great toys that this unit offers. First thing that's going to grab your attention in this Vantage product is going to be the vaulted ceilings. As you can see, this trailer inside here, the extended ceiling height really opens this trailer up. We got a seven inch on center vaulted ceiling. Um, just adds a lot of ceiling height, a lot of interior room. Next thing you notice is the width of this trailer. This is, this is a true 102 inch wide trailer. Um, something different than we've ever seen before and they do it by actually curving the exterior walls, putting a curve to it. Totally different construction than what they've been using in the past in travel trailers. It's almost a motorhome construction. They use a vacuum bonded wall that they can put a curve to with aluminum structuring inside the wall for strength and also to save weight as opposed to wood. Just cutting edge technology. I think we're going to see that more and more in the travel trailer business. But uh, Vantage is the first one to get it out there. Just from the inside, you see a lot of neat features in this. Notice the front rounded walls. There's not a lot of angles inside this travel trailer. Just Makes it makes it very newish looking on the inside. Curves on both the front corner walls here. And you also notice they match it up with the same curve on the front wall there. Big window off the front, which we've seen before in the past. One thing that's pretty neat, it's got a big leather sofa across the front. Inside this leather sofa, storage underneath. You know, we're making that lifestyle change. Plenty of storage here underneath. Huge sofa across the front. Tinted safety glass in all the windows. We'll see from outside too, these aren't normal windows, these are frameless windows and we'll, we'll look at that, they seal a little bit better, we're going to have a little better R value to them. We'll check that out as we get there. One of the surprising things in this, look at this household faucet style on this camper. I mean, it's really a nice feature. It's also going to have a deep sink, um, not an oversized sink, but a nice deep sink. Allows you to do your dishes, pots and pans, but yet it leaves plenty of counter space for doing a lot of other stuff too. Even the slide out. As you can see from this fascia here, it's a little bit curved to match that curved sidewall. Just a really, really wide open trailer. Roller drive, no, excuse me, metal slide bearing rollers on all the drawers. Easy, easy slide in and out. One thing I was just talking to Josh about, look at how much we got down here in this drawer. I mean, in a travel trailer, you don't find that every day. A lot of times it's just top storage or we get a cabinet door that opens up. Here again, full length drawer slides on both, both dinette sides, so. Plenty of storage for everybody. When we come inside, you'll notice we got stainless steel appliances in this trailer also too. And that's just cutting edge. It makes it look classy, a little nicer finish. As you know, people buy stainless steel appliances for their house. Keystone's looking for that same effect and feel in here. Just a little recessed lighting in the ceiling in this. We also have nice lighting over our dinette chair here. So when we're talking about all the cutting edge stuff that's out there in the market, it's all being put inside this trailer. The ducted air conditioning, the laminated floor. This isn't just a, you know, this isn't a plywood floor. This is actually a laminated one-piece floor. It's going to hold up. It's lighter. It's going to hold up longer. There's not seams every four feet. It's just one piece of laminated, so, flooring. And that's just stuff that makes this trailer a little nicer than the rest. So. What we're going to do is I'll take you back in the bedroom in this. That's where we're going to notice all the big mirrors, the big windows, and those sort of things. And I think you guys are going to be really impressed with that. Right, so let's take a quick look at the bedroom on this Vantage product. You know, first thing we're going to notice is still the vaulted ceilings, the rounded sidewalls. gives us plenty of room. There's a private suite back here that's probably the nicest bedroom I've seen in a long time in a travel trailer. Not only do you get the nice bedroom, private feel of it, but you even get your own stand-up walk-in closet. Shelf on the top, you can put your shoes up there, duffel bags, anything you need. Hanging clothes rod that goes runs all the way across. And we got plenty of room on the storage down on the bottom. So if you're looking for extra storage for suits or clothing that you want to hang up, winter coats, it could be anything. This trailer's got a heated underbelly, so if you want to do that extended seasonal camping, you can bring your winter gear with you. It also has a rounded interior sidewall inside that closet, so it gives you also that extra room on both sides. So if you're looking for extra storage, in a master suite, this is the floor plan for you. 
You can tell just by looking at the outside of this van, it's different than anything we've seen before. We talked a lot of, a little bit about it when we're on the inside, but when you're looking at the outside of this trailer, look at the curve of this trailer. This trailer is a true, true 102 wide. Most RVs are eight foot wide, so you get that extra length, that extra width. And how they do it is by curving this exterior wall, which is really neat. Totally different construction than we find on normal travel trailers. This is called vacuum bonded construction. So inside this wall, we have a aluminum structure for strength and rigidity. And what they do is under heat and high pressure, they actually compress the wall and give it this shape. Same thing, technology they've been using on high end motorhomes for a few years now. And what this like, smoke exterior color is, this is actually dyed fiberglass. So this is not painted. So if this gets scratched, it's going to be this smoke color straight through. It does the nice high gloss wall finish on this too, so you're getting a long term shine to it. It's going to hold up well traveling down the roads. It's going to look good for a long, long time. Little stuff too, you'll notice the sloped awning arms. That's something they had to come up with. Hey, we've got a sloped trailer, we're going to be a sloped awning arm. So just all around, Keystone's really cutting edge on this. Aluminum rims, the same weight, also looks a little bit nicer. But inside this aluminum rim here, we're going to find Deep down in it, it's got more ride suspension on it. This camper has the new CRE 3000 suspension, bringing it three inches of vertical travel. Brand new for Keystone this year. More ride is making this right now on a few Keystone products, and this one's got it on it. If we go back a little bit too, you're going to notice here on some of the windows. Why do these windows look different? These are called frameless windows. They actually seal from the inside. There's no exterior exclusions. So it seals from the inside, a more classy look a dark tinted safety glass to it all the way around. If you come to the door here and we open up the door, you'll even notice the door is going to slope to it. Because that's how they're getting that extra six inches on this trailer. Well, if you guys have any interest at all in a new lifestyle trail, this Vantage product is probably the unit for you guys. We stock it here at Pete's RV Center or Indiana store and our Vermont store. And we've got many floor plans in stock. So if you're looking for a Vantage, Pete's RV is the place for you. Thank you very much and we'll talk to you soon.